Explanation of the default screen and functions of the LED are as follow. Plug the power cord into a machine socket. Plug the foot controller into the machine socket. Plug the power cord into the power supply socket. Turn on the power switch. Juki logo will be displayed on the LCD. The chain of thread cutting button will be displayed, so please press the chain of thread cutting button. Be aware that the chain of thread cutter will move. The initial screen is displayed. Rabbit mark indicates that the maximum sewing speed and 9 on the display indicates the ninth of 10 levels of maximum sewing speed. 2.5 indicates the stitch length. The unit is millimeter. Adjust by turning the stitch length adjustment dial to change the length to your liking. N stands for differential ratio. N stands for neutral, normal, but it can be adjusted by turning the differential feed adjustment dial when sewing elastic fabrics. This button is automatic chain off thread cutting. When you press this button, chain off thread cutting icon will be displayed at the bottom left of the screen. When this icon is displayed, the chain of thread cutting will be cut automatically after finished sewing. The number 5 represents length of the chain of thread cutting after cutting. That indicates the fifth at 10 level, about 5 cm. While fabric is in the sensor, the fabric detection sensor icon will be displayed at the top of the LCD as on. If fabric is off from sensor, the display changes to off. This button is for display button for thread. When this button is touched, the thread display screen will display for 5 seconds. The A on the left icon indicates stitch symbol. There are four types of stitch symbol that are A, B, C, and D. Switch the thread type with the stitch changeover knob. Two needle, four thread overlock is the name of the C. The needle display indicates the number and position of needles to be set. This is the direction of the selection lever for overlocking or roll hemming. This display indicates that to put the overlocking claw forward. 2.5 is the recommended seam length. Press the stitch display button, returning to the sewing screen after 5 seconds have passed or before. Press the Edit button to move the Edit Item Selection screen and then change various settings. This is the Selection screen. This is the Selection bar. You can edit items with this Selection bar. This indicates the maximum sewing speed. This indicates the automatic chain of thread cutting length. This indicate the hand LED illumination. This indicate the hand LED color temperature. This is the LCD contrast adjustment. This represents what is happening when you step on the foot switch. The next page appears when you press the right button. This indicate language display. EN stands for English. Press the Edit button for returning to the sewing screen. 
change the maximum sewing speed. Enable to adjust a 10 speed level, and 1 is the slowest one. Here, set the maximum sewing speed to 5. Press the Edit button to switch to the editing screen. Make sure there's a selection bar under the maximum sewing speed. Press the Enter button to switch to the editing screen. This is an editing screen to change the maximum sewing speed. Set is display in the upper left of the editing screen. Press the left button to 5 to change the sewing speed. Press the Enter button to return to the selection screen. And then press the Edit button, returning to the sewing screen. Change the length of automatic chain-off thread cutting. The length of automatic chain-off thread cutting is 1 is the shortest, and able to adjust at 10 level. The maximum length of automatic chain-off thread cutting is about 10 cm, and the minimum length is about 1 cm. Here, set the automatic chain-off thread cutting length is 8 cm. Press the Edit button to switch to the selection screen. Press the right button to move the selection bar under the automatic chain-off thread cutting length. Press the Enter button to switch to the editing screen. Press right button to change proxy 8 cm of 8 of automatic chain-off thread cutting length. Press the Enter button to return to the selection screen. And then, Press the Edit button, returning to the sewing screen. The chain of thread cutting length varies depending on sewing conditions, such as the type of thread and stitch length. Change the color temperature of the hand LED. Able to be adjusted in 11 steps, and zero is the lowest color temperature. Here, Set it to 10, that is the warmest color. Press the Edit button to switch to the selection screen. Press the right button to move the selection bar under the hand LED color temperature. Press the Enter button to switch to the editing screen. Press the right button changing to a maximum color temperature to 10. Press the Enter button to return to the selection screen. After that, press the Edit button to return to the sewing screen. Change behavior when stepping on the foot switch. The foot switch can be selected from half stitch and chain off thread cutting button. Here, Change to Chain Off Thread Cutting button. Press the Edit button to switch to the selection screen. Press the right button to move the selection bar under the machine operation carried out by depressing the foot switch. Press the Enter button to switch to the editing screen. Press the right button to change the Chain Off Thread Cutting. Press the Enter button to return to the selection screen. After that, press the Edit button, returning to the sewing screen. To return to the half stitch, press the left button on the editing screen to return to the half stitch. And press the Enter button to return to the editing screen. Then, press the Edit button to return to the sewing screen. 